Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. In today's video we're going to be playing Sea of Stars, uh, which is a game that I've been looking forward to for quite a while now. Um, I've been following this game uh, for like, I think, a year now. Uh, I've always thought it looked interesting, uh, and I was going to buy it originally. I didn't know what price it was, uh, but I would assume it would have been like 20 25 maybe at most $30. Um, but no, it was $35, uh, which I still think it would be worth it for an RPG especially. But because it was added to PS Plus and also Game Pass uh, for free when it came out, I played this game a little bit. Uh, I only played it for like an hour, but we're going to be playing more of it today. Uh, so yeah, let's just get right into it. Uh, let's continue. You can see exactly where I left off here. Um, but yeah, so far from what I played the game, like, like see, this is where I left off here. Uh, where these two are barely going out on their adventure or whatever. Uh, yeah, uh, from what I played, I actually really enjoyed playing the game, but I haven't had time to really go back into it. Why? Because, uh, other games, you know, just Splatoon stuff, I don't know. Uh, let's see. Let's just, uh, continue on. Sure feels easier now. This time we make it through. And also, it got pretty graphic already. This game is apparently rated E for E10 or whatever. And it got pretty graphic with, like, their friend, their childhood friend, uh, uh, getting, like, stabbed in the eye and there was, like, blood or something. Like, what the heck? Yeah, obviously E for everyone, right? I mean, E everyone 10 and up, but uh, still, like, what the heck? <laughs> uh, so where do we go? Do we go here? What? I don't understand your accent. Uh, what? Am I missing something here? Wait, what? Oh! I forgot. Okay. Didn't realize I had to jump. Also, I have to time it like right to use the. To you both uh, attack and defend. Ah. Spike shower. Okay. Wait, what is that? Oh, okay, that's that. Hey, that looks like a hammer. Am I wrong? But yeah, this game uh, gives me big, uh, well, like classic RPG vibes. But see, people say it gives them like Chrono Trigger vibes. Definitely see that, even though I never played Chrono Trigger. Uh, Rocket League got updated. That was my last gameplay video. If you want to check that out. Uh, but yeah, um, like I was saying, um, but it also gave me a bit of Xenoblade vibes, especially because like the game's soundtrack is like made by someone that did Xenoblade songs. I believe. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure that was confirmed. Okay. Oh, we can go up here. Nice. Okay. It also gives me like Final Fantasy vibes as well. But this game is like, from what I played, it's still very different even from despite those similarities to other games, you know? Found Adventurer's Vest. Cool. And I like how there's no random encounters to that just makes the game like ten times better <laughs> in my opinion. Oh guys, so uh, let me tell you 
like give you an update on some of the things I mentioned in the last gameplay video. Uh, so, so yeah, I decided to keep Rocket League. I initially deleted it. Honestly, I deleted Rocket League, but I realized it was fun from what I played, and I decided to keep it. Uh, I also tried uh, Billy. I also tried to play after Rocket League got done. I played a little bit of uh, a little bit more of Fortnite, and I decided to keep it as well. I was thinking of getting rid of Fortnite because I was big into Fortnite, but uh, I kind of fell off it mostly because of the fact that I, I got tired of doing the weekly stuff uh, for the the weekly. You know, why am I blinking on the what? What does that do? Okay, um, you know the challenges, but I also I just ran out of space on my Switch, uh, but I played it a little bit more and I actually enjoy playing Fortnite. It's locked. Maybe the key is in the chest just up there. Okay. It's out of reach for now. Let's look around. Um, but yeah, uh, I don't know, uh, if I'll ever fully get back into like Fortnite, like, you know, uh, oh, cool. Like, uh, you know, like I'll buy the battle passes again. Like, I have enough V-Bucks, you know, to, to buy another battle pass if I wanted to. I don't know if I'll ever do that, though, but uh, maybe. Found the Forbidden Cavern Key. Also, I like how the text is pretty big. I, I have this problem with some games where, like, the text is too small. Even if it was too small when I was in my, you know, in my in the living room here where I had the bigger TV it was too small and sometimes I had to like get up or get closer or something but it's it's sometimes harder now with the smaller TV I'm playing at playing with here so it's just nice to have some games with like bigger text or at least an option to, to do that but anyway uh, so wait where do we go again Wait, am, am I, am I, oh, do I bring this down, right? Ooh. Okay, okay. Uh, but yeah, um, but I decided to keep Fortnite. I also tried, uh, Overwatch, uh, and I didn't really like it. Uh, it was kind of confusing. Uh, I tried to do, to do, like, the second part of the tutorial, and the game was like, oh, uh, what's this? Uh, learn combo skill m mending light. Okay. What does that do? Does that heal me or something? Oh. Okay, but uh, um, like I was saying, uh, uh, I tried to do the second part of the t tutorial for Overwatch and it wouldn't let me continue. I eventually figured out what to do. I just mashed buttons until it finally worked, but I was pushing the right buttons and it didn't work for me. Like it's the one where like you have to communicate with your team, do like the D-pad or something and it wouldn't register. Anyway, Leeching Thorn, cool. Uh, I've, I've looked it up and lots of people had that same problem too. So I don't know, um, but plus you know, I played like two matches and I didn't really like it that much. So I deleted it. Uh, yeah. Uh, also tried to play a little bit of, uh, Sky, uh, not Sky, uh, what's it called? S Skyrim? Yeah, Skyrim. Uh. I played a I tried to play a little bit of Skyrim, and guess what, guys? Uh, I played a little bit of it. I got to the part where I created my character, uh, and uh, I was about to do the executed scene where your character looks like they're about to be executed or something. Um, and then I'm guessing you don't or whatever. But then it froze. The game froze on me uh, when that happened. So that was cool. And apparently lots of other people say Skyrim on PS5 also crashes for them and like for a lot of people they have to put mods or something to like skip that part that why 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 that's so stupid that just made me not want to play skyrim honestly but even then from what i saw like gameplay of skyrim i don't think it would be for me i think it would just be kind of boring for me 
but yeah, that just really disheartened me to even try to continue it because I lost progress. Like yeah, at the beginning of the game, but still, like it crashed. I'd never seen a PS5 game crash on me like before. Like yeah, I've only had a PS5 for like what a month. Uh, well, I've I've seen videos of people play PS5 games. Uh, wait, do they just go in a big fat circle? Is there something over here that I missed? But yeah, um... Is there something here now? Oh, oh, okay. But, uh... Yeah, that, uh... What was I saying? Uh, hold on. The device is broken, we can't activate the bridge. Also, are these guys... I don't know, I still don't know what their relationship is like. They seem like friends, but I don't know if they're like siblings or, you know... Maybe to develop some kind of, you know, relationship in the future, you know? Uh, like, I don't know what their relationship is exactly. Uh, there seems to be a decor through there to the left. Worth a shot. Okay. But yeah, that, uh, I didn't want to play Sky more Skyrim because of that, so... Yeah. Oh yeah, and I've seen, uh, people play PS5 games and I've never seen them crash. Set camp. What does this do? I wish we could go back for our gar gall. Uh, I guess we could rest. And then we all die. The end. Okay, that was worthless? Or maybe that healed us? I don't know. Jesus Christ. Uh, Valerie? I don't know how you say their names exactly. Sounds big. Get ready. Look at that thing. Okay. I do have the special things like skills. Hold X. Oh, nice, cool. Wow. Skills. Ah, dang it. Mother Trucker. Really? That did big damage. Oh, you, you idiot. I thought it was the guy for a second. Uh, no bite on combo. Can I do a combo? Oh, could I have done that too? Like, time it right? Probably. Stop it. Okay, I need to heal. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, items. Dang. Ah, oh, it does it's the other one. Okay, but that still did pretty good damage. Hold on, slashes the enemies in an arc. Okay, at least I killed them. <sighs> Combo. Oh, 
Okay. No, please don't, don't die, don't die, uh... Okay, okay, okay. Let's use skills to pay the bills. Okay, okay, that's fine, I guess. Healing light. Oh, that did like barely anything, dude. Ah. Okay. Come on. I think we need to do this for her. Come on. Oh, okay, okay. Skills? No. This one? I thought I pushed it too soon for a second. Ah, sl slugged? Oh, yes, we beat it. Nice. Nice. Got 80 experience points? Nice. Our first big one. Haha, <laughs> we did it. Looks like there is a way out over there. The mountain shouldn't be much farther now. Nice. Oh, I almost left without this. 60 gold and adventurer's vest. So, uh, I forgot, how do you open the... Can you not open the menu here? Uh, I guess not. I uh, no. Whatever, oh, I'm glad we did it. What's over here though? Uh, there's a shortcut? Oh, nice, it's a shortcut, thank you. Appreciate it. We did it, guys. I'm happy. Things are starting to move. I am eager to see what these two can do. What is this, like the like the Mobius guys from Xenoblade 3 or something? Eager and impatient too. For now, we wait. Jury, you know what to do. Okay. Uh, I guess we could go here. Oh, fishing? Hey there, would you look f looking for anything in particular? Uh, bye. Oh, that would be good. Ventures Fest. I have two. How do I equip that? Am, am I equip? Okay, uh, equip. Equip it. I need the vest. Why? I'm out of tomatoes. 
Wait, but how do I equip things? Options. Controls. Game menu. All oh, right, it's that button. Okay, equip. Yeah. Okay, I'm stupid. Okay. Okay, there we go. Okay. Skills, items, order. Uh, okay. Relics. Okay, okay. There we go. Okay, I was like, how do I do it? I forgot that that's how you open the menu. Also, I know that this is pretty useful, like, fishing for, uh... Uh, for... to get, like... Uh, like, ingredients for food or something? Do I have to tap it, or what do I have to do? Ah! What? Oh no, I'm confused. I want to try to do this. Hold on. At least one fist, you know? Okay, nice, okay. I was mashing the button too, uh, but also I was just moving the D-pad around, okay. Okay, let's do a few more fishing. If we succeed, you know. Ah. Do I have to mass it? I don't, I don't know, I don't think I do actually. I don't get it exactly. I guess I could go back to what I did before. I guess mashing works. Fine, I guess I'll just mass. Mother trucker. Okay, we'll continue on with the the game in a bit. The story too, I guess. Okay. You cut a lumber drop. Okay. Let's do one more, one more fist, and then we'll be done. Okay, that's enough fishing, in my opinion. We can always come back later. Okay, let's see. What's over here, though? What is this? Sunrise sign? Shrine? Oh, we could save here. Yes. Uh -oh. 
it's locked. Okay, I guess we can go here. Okay. At least we saved our progress. Okay, well, we can go in here then. Mountain Trail. Mountain Trail, Mountain Trail. Oh, hey, this is where we started the beginning of the game with. Alright, we made it to the Mountain Trail. So far, so good. So the older miss lives somewhere here, huh? Yeah, and then that's that's where we began the game. Okay, okay. So we're all cut up now. Cool. I really hope we'll get a chance to return to Moon Cradle after this. What if we're sent out into the world right away? Yeah, I don't know. I just wish Gar was here. We could certainly use some Celestial Willow Jam to go with this awful bread. Aha, the dream. Huh? Celestial Willow Jam? <gasps> it's him! I've got some right here, guys. Oh my god, it's him! I even picked some mushrooms. You won't believe this soup off I'll make. Oh my god, it's him! It's the boy! It's the boy! Or oh, I found some herbs in the Forbidden Cavern. They'll do just right. Garl! Uh, what? You didn't really think I was going to let you go on an adventure without me, did you? Gar, and then... Uh, that's really sweet. I saw this on Twitter, uh, or X, whatever you call it. Um, I didn't know it was exactly this moment, but I knew they would be reunited uh, at some point, but that's really cool. Okay, It's so great. It's good to, good to see you two again. You look so strong now. Hey, why did you so out for our departure? Are you kidding? There was absolutely no announcement. As soon as I heard everyone gathered, I went to our hideout to pack my stuff, but you left so fast. Guys, I'm so pumped for this journey. I know all about survival now. Fishing and gathering and cooking and... What's wrong? You can't actually come with us. We just wanted to say goodbye. We're on duty now and it's pretty dangerous. You can't mean that. We're always talked about how we'll all leave together after your training. Plus I spent all those years practicing in our little cave. I'm ready. Look, I may not have any special powers like you do, but I'm built strong and I've been prepared. This Here's my shield, I'll be a defensive fighter. No, a warrior cook. Oh yeah? Sure, and I've been reading a lot too. See, most of the monsters you're going to face won't even, won't even be flesh master minions, which means anyone can fight them. Are you sure about that? Totally, you haven't seen any yet, have you? No, but... Although when to step aside, don't worry. But she can't really travel the world with just a few salvages. What are you, what were you thinking? That's yeah. See, you need me. You just do your solist, solist warrior duties, and I'll keep your bellies full. Car, deal. Okay, deal. But I'm oh, I'm so happy. No way, this is awesome. Ha ha ha. Alright, I'll start the kettle. We have so much chatting up to do. Uh, it's just, it's great. The guard, the warrior cook joins the party. It's really cool uh, because I saw on Twitter or whatever that like, you see characters are like fixing most of the time when they say, when they haven't seen each other for a while, they're like, oh, how have you been? And they're so happy, but they don't give each other a hug. These, this time they do, and I'm really happy about that. Uh, And so apparently after we've met this Elder Mist, we'll be able to use magic without using magic and be sent out into the world. <sighs> That's all we've been told. I guess finding our own way is the final step of training. Our first assignment is to go get to Wrath Island in time for the next eclipse. Wow, that's a lot. Your powers sound so cool though. Can't wait to see them in action. So how about you, Gar? Well, it was pretty uneventful to be honest. All I did was train and learn the skills I thought would come in handy. Every single day I was hoping to see you come out. I'm sure 
glad no one told me. I'm sure glad no one told me it would take 10 years. <laughs> yeah, we missed you too. It's not fair that we worked together and you, that we worked together and you had to do this on your own. Yeah. Oh, we're all together now, so it doesn't matter anymore. And I can't wait to explore a world. I want to taste everything. Oh. Hey, this soup is unreal, by the way. Right? Uh huh. So, how much food did you pack? Just enough for a few meals. It's better to travel light, and there's ingredients everywhere you look, you know to look. And who knows what we'll find? It's all part of the adventure. Why don't you try now, Zazel? See that bush right there is full of juicy berries. All you have to do is pick them. Just one. Okay. Perfect. Now we'll make some jam with the berries you picked. Let's interact with the campfire and get ready to cook. The campfire feels cozy and warm. Cook. Perfect. Now we'll make some jam. Oh my god. Did I not do that? Oh, I have to hold it. Okay. See, you're a natural. We can eat that jam later when we need to heal up. Thanks for the tips, Gar. That's going to come in handy for sure. Don't mention it. Yeah, I'm really, f I'm ready for some sleep. Same here. And nothing but the stars above us. I'm loving this life already. Gar, I'm really ha glad you're here. I know, me too. Haha, <laughs> I, I was just thinking, just about to say that. Yeah. Me too, guys. I wouldn't want to be anywhere else. Well, good night then. Mm. It's so happy that they're all reunited. That's cool. Good morning. You all ready to go? I'm excited to see what this Elder Mist looks like. Should we straight up? Let's keep hiking. Okay. We got a save point here. That's good. Um. Honestly, guys, I think that's going to be it for the video. Uh, we could continue on, of course, for like a few more minutes. But honestly, I think I want to be done. But so far, I really enjoy playing this game. Uh, I cannot wait to play more of it. I'm already hooked on the characters, on the on the story, the world, you know. I cannot wait to play more of it. Uh, but yeah, um, let me know. Do you want me to play more of this on the channel? I was originally going to do this as a live stream. But then... Uh, Things came in the way, like uh, Splatoon had an update, so I had to cover that. Many other things happened, or whatever. Um, but yeah, let me know if you want me to cover this more. But uh, yeah, really enjoyed this game so far, and I highly recommend it. Especially if you have uh, Game Pass or PS Plus, it's free on there. Or if you just have a Switch like I once did, it's $35, which is a tad more expensive than I thought it would have been. But it still would be worth it, just because of the fact that it's an RPG. RPGs are pretty long. Um, also, I like the title screen. That's cool. Um, but yeah, guys, that's gonna be it. Uh, like, subscribe, please. I'm see you, and I'll catch you guys next time for more. Peace.